and for the network enumeration uh, there are some the commands for uh, for tracing or we can say that identify that ip addresses and also first of all we can see that if config so we can figure out like how many that interfaces are connected in that particular server like docker 0 ethernet 0 and that local host because like right now i'm using that virtual machine so that's why i'm uh that see that limited number of uh that interfaces but if i'm using the directly server so maybe there are some like multiple interface or maybe you'll get that only one interface but you can identify uh, with the help, help of that if config and the interface name and other than uh, the ip address that allocated to that respective interfaces now uh, we can see uh, that other details with the help of ip root so default wire uh, we can see that my private ip address that ethernet uh, then dhcp src then metric 100 uh, then it's a subnet something then docker 0 and like uh, like there are multiple information so when we connect it to the server we'll get some that uh, some interesting information with the help of that ip root or we can use that ip uh, so we can use uh, this command also so that's a style style and uh, the dev ethernet zero ethernet zero so now we can see uh, that connected for in network it's that only that one interface which is that eth zero so we can identify uh, with the help of uh, that ip NAC command and uh, like if i want to see that more information like uh, that foreign address connected or like other ip address connected in particular that server so we can use that same command which we are using in windows operating system which is net state hyphen ano so let's see so in hyphen ano we can see all connected commands uh, with particular that uh, process id so we can identify uh, which service is running on and uh, which ports are connected let's say uh, there is some loopback ip which is port number is 39425 and connected to uh, that loopback ip and that it's in listen mode and established we can see that udp uh, that 192.168.201.28 port number 68 which connected to that 67 it's established and in row 6 uh, there are some active unix domain sockets where we can identify some that interesting information and we'll definitely uh, see during that privilege escalation different different type of methods or different different type of ctfs boxes